Hey YouTube, what up? TYP336 here, <laughs> bringing you my recap on Worlds, um, the Yu-Gi-Oh! Worlds 2010 Championship. Uh, as, far, as far as the winner goes, don't think he deserved it. He's using Frog OTK and a bad one at that, because he couldn't even pull off the OTK from the bad coverage I read from on Yu-Gi-Oh! Dash card. So, yeah, bad coverage and bad player, so, yeah, I'll, I'll automatically makes it a bad tournament. For a bad winner and a and bad coverage on the bad winner, and just as far like as far as the coverage went, it was just terrible. They didn't tell anything. They didn't do anything like they do for the YCSs and nationals. They don't get. They don't give good coverage like that. I don't understand why. That's the biggest tournament of the year. It honestly is. It. Or well, anybody that knows Yu-Gi-Oh that well honestly knows that the Worlds is the biggest tournament of the year. And just like, why wouldn't you do the same thing for for Worlds that you do for these YCSs in states? This is for a world tournament. People from countries are coming all the way from their homes to come to California. They came all the way from their homes in different countries to come to California to play a card game and you're not even going to give them the ro the right coverage they deserved. This is crazy. And just like what is causing the sudden raids these past few months in Yu-Gi-Oh. This Jeff Jones getting punched in the face and Nas and Nationals and getting and getting his wallet stolen. Shane Scurry getting arrested for stealing cards. And some random guy putting his head through a or putting his head through a wall, getting knocked out, and getting the shit stolen. What's causing this rage and stupidity all of a sudden? Just it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. But you know, it's like a little bit more on the coverage. Just like how they did it was stupid because they only covered the final match. Just. When they cut, like when they was covering the final match, they don't, they they didn't really tell how the how the person won the ma won the duel, won, won the game in in the match. It would be like, oh, he won, oh, he lost, oh, he summons Lad and wins. He attacks for game. It's like, okay, how many turns went by before he attacked for game? And he's oh, and the guy from Panama summons Black Rose Dragon during the during the game or whatever. And like, okay, how did he summon Black Rose Dragon? What was his synchro materials? Like, we want to know. They didn't do any deck analysis or anything. It was just, it's just, Worlds coverage is just bad. I hate looking at the coverage for Worlds. I just, just every year I was like, maybe they'll do something different. But, no. They'll ne never do anything different as far as Worlds go. Um... Shout out, uh, shout out to Shin Fence for his good for his good coverage in his videos he did for Worlds. Good job, man! I really enjoyed your videos. I just got done watching one, to be honest. <laughs> and yeah, that's about it. Oh, shout out to Edge Fan or Edge Man Ten Eleven for uh, like I owed him a I owed him a shout out to my friend Mike T. He had, uh, he has a YouTube channel as well. Just like check out his videos. His videos are cool, funny. Just check, just give him, a sh just subscribe to him. And yeah, that's about it. I'll do my thoughts on the new band list this week, and that'll be up soon. And yeah, that's about it. TLP three three six out. Peace, guys.